Hi everyone, today I'm going to be going over one of my favorite books of all time, which is Life Expectancy by Dean Koontz. I really can't say what it is about this book, but there's something about it that just keeps calling me back again and again and again. And I could just, I don't even know why, but I just connect with it so deeply. Um, to start off with, it's about Mr. Jimmy Talk. So what is so special about Jimmy? Well, first off, he's a baker. So this is where I get really excited because I am to this day surprised that I never went to baking school. And then, um, you know, I still haven't met a baked good that I haven't loved. So uh, the fact that he can bake and bakes well is beyond me and I absolutely love that about him. Another reason is that he's he has syndactyly, which is where the webbing between your fingers and your toes extends. So some of your fingers or toes may be attached just to give a quick, uh, very uh, vague rundown with that and another reason the day he was born uh, his grandfather prophesied that he would live through five absolutely horrendous days so not only does uh, do, does everybody know that he's gonna live through these five horrible days but they also know the specific date so this entire book is about how he goes through his life knowing these days are gonna happen and when they're gonna happen and how he deals with it and it's a book that's absolutely filled with heartbreaking moments. It's filled with a lot of dark humor, which is one of my favorite parts about this book. And for those of you that may have a little bit of a clown phobia, maybe you read it when you were too young or watched the movie when you were a little bit too young, either way, there's a clown phobia. There are actually two clowns in this story. They pop up every so often to make Jimmy's life a little bit uh, traumatic and hectic. However, there's nothing supernatural about them. They're just your run-of-the-mill um, psychotic humans. Um, so don't worry, they're, they're definitely not Pennywise. So um, there's that, but it is one of my favorite books. If you're into dark humor, this is definitely the one that you're gonna wanna read. So Life Expectancy by Dean Koontz, one of my all-time favorite books. And then now, because I finished that, I don't actually know what to read. So I ended up going through my to be read pile. I put all of the titles on pieces of paper in a fishbowl. So I'm hoping you guys might be able to help me put some more entries in here so that I have a lot more to choose from. So hit up the comments and put in your favorite books and I will add them to my bowl here and then I will happily pick the next time I do a review. Let's see what we got today. We have Peter and the Star Catchers by Dave Barry and Ridley Pearson. I don't know if you can see that right there. And then let's see what the back has to say. All right, the synopsis says it's an in an evocative and fast-paced adventure on the high seas and on a faraway island, an orphan boy named Peter and his mysterious new friend Molly overcome bands of pirates and thieves on their quest to keep fantastical secrets safe and the world from evil. So you know what? That sounds right up my alley, which is probably why it's been in my to be read pile. There's the cover for you. So I will get to reading this and I will let you know what I think when I'm done. Thanks so much. Remember, it's all about the stories. Bye.